creating <laughs> fake profiles online. It might be easy to do, but it is actually a crime here in Texas. So when a Houston woman found out someone created a fake profile with her name and started making alarming posts, she went to the police. Grace White shows us what happened next. Woke up like a typical day thinking it was going to be just a chill Labor Day, and I received a couple of message requests on my private Instagram account. Kelsey Zalesack woke up on Labor Day and had no idea what was coming. About an hour later, my boss reached out to me and sent me screenshots of these girls messaging him saying, you should fire this employee. Zalesack says the fake TikTok account with her name and picture was leaving comments on other people's videos she couldn't believe. And one of them was like, you're a bad mom. I don't have children. I have no right to judge anyone on their mothering. Another one, you know, it's so sad, like saying, I hope your kids die. You know, um, anyone that would do this to you, any uh, enemy uh, or mm -hmm. prior relationship? I no, I've been in the same relationship for a few years. There's a law in place that bans this type of activity, especially if you're using uh, the, the fake account to intimidate, to hurt, to threaten. Crime Stoppers' Rania Mancario says you can be charged with online impersonation, but the cases are tricky. The problem is the social media platforms are not that clear, and they allow fan accounts, they allow parody accounts, they allow commentary accounts, so it truly blurs the line. She says you should report fake accounts to the social media platform, send a message to the user letting them know you're calling police, and take as many screenshots as you can. Zalesek says she contacted Houston police and TikTok. My hope is that whoever's doing this doesn't go on to the next person and say, Hey, I can steal someone else's other name information and, and no, do this again. The fake account was taken down, but the damage is hard to erase. Grace White, KHOU, 11 News.